Hey everyone, today's January 6, 2019, and I hope all of you are having a great day today. And I hope all of you had a great holiday and a great new year. So it's been a little less than two weeks since I made a video, and between that video and now, obviously if you guys have watched my previous video, I moved into my new condo, which I'm at right now, and I had a lot going on in my life, a lot of positive things with my job, with my new place here with stuff, and a lot of awesome things happening. So it is January in Chicago, that means it is winter and not a lot of car events are going on right now. And in about two months from now, when March comes around, that's when car events start popping up, meets, everything starts happening, which is only two months away from now. And at that time, I'm also going to put back on my Work Emotion CR Kiwamis. So if you guys didn't know, my Work Emotion CR Kiwamis, um, those are my dream wheels. I had those for last season, and I've been debating on selling them, but I decided recently that I'm going to keep them because they look great on my car. If you're new to the channel, if you don't know what those wheels are and what my car looks like, I'll put a picture of my car with my Work Emotion wheels on the screen right now. So it feels good to pick up the camera again. And I have a lot of awesome things happening for this video. I have a couple new mods I have for the BRZ and a lot of big things coming for the car very soon. So the winter time in Chicago is the time we use to build our cars up for this upcoming show season. So there's a couple months left of this winter until spring comes around, until March, April when it starts getting warmer outside. And I'm excited to get everything together for my car and share that with all of you. With moving into my new condo, with everything happening with my new job I've been extremely busy but I always want to make content for all of you share everything I'm doing I have a couple mods I have right now that I will be installing on my BRC very soon and I'll show you one of them right now so we are on my second balcony in my condo the one connected to our bedroom right now and in our storage closet here I have my new aftermarket overpipe, which is right there, and my new front pipe. The brand is Speed by Design, which is a great brand, and this overpipe is going to make airflow much better. And the front pipe right here, this is a catless overpipe, but it has a resonator. So it'll make my car sound awesome with my JDL unequal length header and my NVIDIA N1 catback exhaust. These will be put on very, very soon, not today, but I have other modifications that will be installed. Right now I'm heading to my buddy John's house. He has that blue, beautiful supercharged FRS that I did a video on not too long ago. So I'm heading to John's house right now, and really quick I'll show you one of the modifications I am putting on my car in a little bit. All right. All right, guys. So one thing I'm putting on today, it's a small modification that'll make a big difference, but it'll be these two pieces right here. So this small arrow piece right here is actually a TRD bumper canard, and it'll make my front end of my car look that much more aggressive. Because right now, like I said, I do have my gruddy front lip on my car. It looks great, but with my new wing, I definitely need more aggressive arrow pieces in the front and back of my car. So I'll be getting these installed on my car today. Also, one other thing I have to do. So I'm gonna head down to my garage right now. Hope you guys enjoy today's video and let's get going confident with wiring. Anything with wiring for radios in the cars, for the lights in the cars, I am not comfortable doing it. Yes, I can install tail lights, no problem. Super easy, because it's a plug and play, no problem. But my only issue I'm having right now, which I've had for the last two months and never really had the time to fix it, is my fourth brake light. So this is my Valenti fourth brake light right here, and it is not flashing right. So if you see down there, that, that red triangle is lit up. But that's not supposed to light up unless I brake. And what's supposed to be on at all times is here. So when I press down the brake, this lights up. And I'll show you guys right now. So as you guys saw, 
when I pressed down the brake, the red went on right here, and that's supposed to be like that all the time. So I'm gonna fix my wiring. My friend John's gonna help me out. We're gonna fix this because my fourth brake light, they're connected to my tail lights. The tail lights are correct, and this is incorrect. So we're gonna fix this, install my new TRD canards, and let's get going. I also got new side markers for my BRZ, which I'm gonna pick up from my mailbox right now. Guys, at my buddy John's house. You saw him in a recent video, and on top of that, you saw I did a video on his car several months ago. It wasn't too long ago. And on the way here, I actually bottomed out really bad, like I said earlier, and I actually broke my whip. All right, so on the way here, my front lip bottomed out really bad, ended up cracking this whole side over here. So if you look right here, this whole part is gone right here that goes around my car. So my Goretti front lip is destroyed and unusable at this moment. So with this, I could buy another one. These are really cheap. Or I can get a brand new one, get a whole new look to the whole front end of my car. And we are putting the new aero piece on my car today, which I can use that aero piece with a new lip to get a whole new look for my front end. But we'll see. I might get another Goretti lip, which this will be my third lip. Or like I said, I'll get another one and get a new look for the car. Comment down below what you guys think I should do. Should I get a new front lip? And if you want me to get a new front lip, tell me which one in the comments. Or if I should stay with the gruddy front lip because it looks fine. And I am getting the new canards put on today. It's the bumper canards. And my car is going to look kind of goofy because it's going to have the stock bumper in the front. No lip with the canards. But show season is coming up. It's only January now. I have a couple months left to get my car set up for the season. I have a lot of big things planned for the car. And we'll go from there. So please comment down below. So me and John, we took off my front bumper. That's my first time ever taking it off because I never had to for any reason. And we are putting these TRD canards on there. And it's gonna look good. Make the car look more aggressive because like I said before, with my new Nurse spec style wing I got for my car, um, it does make the back end look more aggressive. And I think I do need a new rear diffuser for the car. Okay, that'll be the second marking. guys so we have one of the canards in right now the TRD canards and this looks aggressive it's gonna look awesome but right now like I said I don't have my gruddy front lip which it'll look kind of goofy but this is definitely looks awesome So we got the TRD canards put on on both sides. We're heating the 3M up and we have the screws in there right now. And we're heating that up so it doesn't move. Looks perfect. And like I said, I don't have my lip on there, which I'm looking for another lip right now. And like I said, before I came here, I told you guys I had an issue with my wiring with my fourth brake light here. And John's gonna help me out with that. I'm not confident in wiring stuff, so he's gonna help me put this together. And once it's corrected, I'll show you guys how it's supposed to look compared to what I showed you guys in the beginning of this video. So, as you can see, the bumper's still off. We'll be putting this back on in a second here. Also, one more thing here. When we get back to the house, I have new side markers for my car. All right, guys, so John fixed my fourth brake light. That's how it's supposed to look right now. And that looks sick, so we'll close this really quick here. Wow. 
that looks much better than it did before. See, that's how perfect. Okay, do that again, put the brake down. Um, do your left signal. There you go. That is perfect. That looks perfect. I'm happy it's back to normal. Um, hazards. This looks so sick. Look at that. And I love the sequential lighting of these Buddy Club version ones with the amber lighting. It looks sick. And I'm happy it's back to how it was. Later that same evening. Alright guys, so I just got back home and the car is looking good right now. A lot of awesome things coming for it. Some unfortunate things happened with my front lip, but that does give me an opportunity to get the same one or a completely new one, which is awesome. So looking at my BRZ here, my side marker, I still didn't install it yet. It's in the mail, I'll do that in a little bit. And if you look right below it, is my new TRD canard and that's gonna look awesome with a really aggressive lip. So this is my gruddy front lip that broke. Um, this whole side piece right here cracked off. As you can see it's not even there, it's just this piece right here. And it's really not that big of a deal. The reason I buy these gruddy lips is one, they look good. And two, they're really cheap, so if anything happens to them, I can easily buy another one or buy a completely different one, which I'm planning on doing. So I'm really happy with the canards right now. They look awesome. And on top of that, John fixed my fourth brake light, and it looks awesome. I'll turn them on right now again to show you guys. All right. Turn on the lights here. All right, so heading back here. Perfect. My fourth brake light on the bottom is working finally. And it looks awesome with my Buddy Club version 1 taillights. That looks perfect. And that looks awesome. Happy that's back to normal now. And the car is coming together nicely. Alright guys, I'm going to end the video right here. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Please leave a comment down below what you guys think of my new TRD canards. It's kind of hard to see how it looks like because there's no front lip on the car. It looks goofy without it. But I promise once I get another front lip, it'll look awesome. And also comment down below if you think I should get another gruddy front lip or a different kind of front lip. And if you want me to get a different kind, please comment comment down below which one I should get. It's going to get warm in Chicago very, very soon. That means a lot of car shows, car events, and I'll be going to all of them. And I have a lot of awesome things, like I keep saying, to my Subaru BRZ. And remember, I respond back to every single comment I get. Peace out, and I'll see you guys in the next video.